What are we talking about today? Yeah. Hello, everybody, and welcome to What Are We Talking About? Today, we're talking about Fear the Walking Dead, episode three, The Dog. Is it The yeah, Dog? Yeah, The Dog. What are your thoughts? Let's talk about first, let's go through each of us and we'll say what we thought was good. So what what did you think was good about the episode? Uh, the story pulled me in right at the good, really, really good at the start of the episode. I, I thought it was cool. Yeah. It, uh, yeah. I like said, yeah. It, uh, overall, I like the story so far about the two families and how he's like caught between them. Yeah. Travis, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Travis. Yeah, he's probably my favorite character so far. Logan, what do you uh, think what did you think that was good? So far I thought yeah, I started off strong, but uh from there it kinda dropped throughout the episode. But no, I thought it started off strong. And again, that Nick Clark, I forget what his name is actually, but Nick Clark in the show, I keep on thinking that his performance is really strong. Like he plays Nick Clark, like the the, Nick, the drug the addict. drug kid. Yeah. Nick Clark, I'm pretty sure his name. Isn't his last name Clark? I don't know. Okay, well, isn't it Nick? Maybe it might be Clark. Nick is I don't his remember. first name for sure. Nick is and he's I thought you meant that the actor's name was Nick Clark, and well, I was the like... The mother's name is Madison Clark. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Because, but no, but like, no when the, you said Nick Clark is his real name, I was like... No, no, it's Nick not his real name. No, like, Clark I don't, is, I don't know, is the actor's name. I don't know name? his real name. I, no, Nick Clark is no, the I know, character. I know, but at first I just thought, oh, yeah, thought yeah. it was kind of weird that both the actor and the character were both named Nick. I was like, no. what? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the actor. Yeah, no, but, but yeah. anyways, no, I think his performance is still pretty good. Like, he yeah. Oh, no, up, I agree. He is he, probably he plays, the best performance of He is of the best everybody. performance of the show yeah. so far, and how he plays a drug addict is one of the best I've seen. On screen, actually, because it, he's not the typical, most people do play the twi tweaker. He plays, like, what I've actually seen from a drug act. Like, they're not completely, they do have intelligence to them. Yeah. But they have that, uh, like, emotional addiction to it. No. I mean, he mm -hmm. displays that. Yeah. So, I, I think that's strong. You? Probably the thing that I noticed that was the biggest strength at least for me was uh how you you get a feeling that it's the whole like it's mass chaos like oh, it's yeah. not just like a sm little bit of chaos it's even hitting the small suburban areas where there's yeah. not a lot of people and shit mm -hmm. right like the yeah. hospital was on fire and the their okay, that was, army yeah. and cops just firing on people in the parking lot of the hospital and shit like it's chaos already I just, it's gonna, and like during the riot, there was a guy getting eaten by a zombie and nobody even noticed. That was where I kind of, like that's what's gonna happen is those people in the riots, those are the ones who are gonna get bit, go home thinking nothing of it, and mm. that's where we're gonna get the mass. It's in this chaos that this zombie virus mm -hmm. is gonna thrive. This is how it's gonna happen. It's because in this all this chaos that we think is just, a civil movement between the citizens and its government is what most people, I imagine, think is going on right now. Yeah. And actually, there's this virus going around that's actually causing all of it, but no one knows yet till it's going to be too late. Like, I feel like because the government didn't tell anyone what was going on, and that the people started just blaming the government, and that helped... It, it helped that chaos happen. Like, yeah. If the government had told the people what was mm -hmm. going on, I think it could have been controlled better. No, I agree. Yeah. But, but the way they went about it was is adding to this chaos and how it's this virus is able to spread amongst in this chaos without being noticed until it's all too late, right? No, no, it did. Yeah. But uh, yeah, in this one, episode, that's my whole thing I was kind of disappointed about. One other good thing, though, was uh, the airplane. Like, it's kind of cool. We're seeing a little bit of this airplane. I don't know if it's the same airplane both times in episode, what was it, two? Oh, and now yeah. this episode three, yeah. we see that airplane, and if it it might be that ex same airplane that they're it gonna do this online like this, special about. It almost seems mm -hmm. like in this episode, the last episode is when we were seeing it go to maybe wherever its first destination was, 
And this time we've seen it, was it coming back? And because now it might... It seems like this time it was in distress when it made mm-hmm. that quick maneuver in the midair, right? No, yeah. that's true. At, right at the end when the army came. So, I don't know. Does anybody, do you have any more positives to talk about? Uh, yeah, no. It, it, it was a good episode. Uh, any more positives? Mm, no. I, I think that we covered them. Yeah. yeah. Okay, now let's move on to things that maybe they could have done a little bit better in okay. this episode. Okay, go ahead and go. First. Let's uh, let's uh, when we when we let's uh, have a little trouble remembering. But yeah, uh, what was the for when was the the for the dra- the, the driving scene uh, at like, night yeah, there. Yeah, the green screen was very obvious. Yeah, it was very obvious. Yeah. Yeah. I noticed. Yeah. yeah, I did. We watched it twice, it, but I didn't notice it the first time we watched it. Oh, I did, but I didn't but, say anything about it. The next time, <clears> the it second, was very, very noticeable. Oh yeah, yeah. Again. They went as far I noticed to even try and put lights. Like at the end of that scene, they had Travis looking out the window, and there was lights in front of it, and there was a reflection of the lights in the window. But they went out. Mm-hmm. I s- appreciate that they t- went that far to put that light effect on it but uh, that green screen was pretty bad yeah <laughs> but yeah. No, i feel because it, it started strong but i feel they skipped over a lot of that chaos that we could have seen like it seems yeah. like they got out of the city really really fast. easily yeah. not to mention the truck, their truck was completely <laughs> unscathed unscathed yeah. like th- no all, every single vehicle was pretty much like the, all the other vehicles around it were pretty much on fire it, it, like if it didn't have any smashed up windows not even a dense like it was unscathed like it already had that uh crack those cr- that big crack i think maybe it seemed like that the crack was bigger than it was before but maybe i'm wrong i don't know i thought it was there beforehand but uh yeah like it, how his truck was just unscathed and how, how they got out of the city so fast yeah, with yeah all that no doubt chaos going on like uh, plus the biggest they skipped over that too much i thought i felt I wanted to see more no, of that. No, that would have been cooler to see away. more. They Hopefully we'll see still more of that. Well, more chaos and big skip. At the end of the amounts. episode, it seems like the military's trying yeah. to put order back into no, exactly. place. But it's probably, like, yeah, we know it's going to fail. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, one other thing that <clears throat> was probably the biggest thing that I found myself on multiple occasions feeling like, shut the door. Nobody oh. shuts the door oh, ever. I know, it's a house. Some of the yeah, decision like, making in this episode yeah, was I, frustrating. As, yeah. Uh, as soon as I seen... The first time that they forgot the shells at the house, it's like, oh, like, the whole reason you guys went over there and you guys forgot the ammunition. Like, no, yeah, definitely. That in the first place is stupid. Her going back all alone, stupid. Like, leaving the doors open were all stupid. Like, it was letting just... the dog in. Yeah, when Travis, when Travis in. came home and then they were in the other house, he was in the front yard, right? Why didn't they go at the front door of that house? It, it was on of... the other side. It was around the block. It wasn't next door. Oh, no. Oh, okay. That makes sense. That makes sense then. Yeah, because remember after when they left their house, they drove around, took a left, yeah. and then they were going to take either, they were taking a right, but then he yeah, was on their left yeah, again, that's right, right? That's right. Yeah. That in the tower, the tower falling on the barber's wife. Yeah, well, yeah. that's the thing. She was like, okay, it was like scaffolding, and it was standing up like this around her. She got bumped into by a guy, and then it fell over, and she and was just like above directed. it, and it landed on her ankle only. She should yeah. have. <clears throat> yeah, she kind of fell out of. The it made doorway. no sense. Yeah. She fell out of the doorway, and for her to have like, like she plainly fell out of the doorway on the ground yeah she should and like for her to somehow like yeah well actually she could have been saved because she was in the hole of the doorway right well yeah because she could have but that's the point though is that she was in the it seemed like she was in the wrong place yeah Yeah, it didn't make sense all of a sudden it was different Mm -hmm. no there and uh overall i'm not a huge fan of whatever trevor's natural like actual kid, son is kid yeah his mm. kid's a bit whiny yeah but mm-hmm. uh I, I like the other characters that, that no, that's actually back to the positives I've, is mm-hmm. i like i we got to see well we've seen them in the last episode but we get to learn more fee, see more of these three new characters the Salazar yeah. our family and uh I, the it seems like the dad is 
into some sort of crime. Mafia or Mafia something, crime. yeah. Because like, he's talking about <clears throat> how he has uh, connections with his cousin and whatever, well, and the fam- way that they said... With his, with his trust with strangers and how he talks up his family. But And plus the way that they said, like, your cousin, it might be also talking about... He's not actually, like, their, their family physically, but it, it's just part of that... Yeah, 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 that's true. Mafia clan or whatever. Because he also gang. talked about there's more in that store than just combs. So it's yeah. probably if that store could pro- very easily be, be a, a front, front. Yeah. for or and that's s- something for knew, the mafia. Uh, he had channel great knowledge behind guns, and he's so cold towards things. Like when he wanted to, burn yeah, when that he just guy. shot that dude yeah. in the face twice, like he shot him from a bit of a, w- a distance, and then just walked up, put the gun right to his face, fucking yeah. boom, blew his head away. And then he just handed the gun away. Yeah, that was another thing. He cocked. A, a double sh- barrel, barrel shotgun. Shot- it was like yeah, an up no and over doubt. Yeah. barrel shotgun, and yeah. it's one of it, like he. They even sh- teach you how to load it in the video. Like I've had, if you, I've gone skeet shooting before. I've used those kind of guns. You have to crack it in half basically to load two shots. No, that's yeah. what right? he even showed that and, later in but the episode. In the scene where he's shooting them, it plainly makes the sound of cocking yeah. rifle twice, twice when he's shooting it. Yeah. It just couldn't have happened. She hands it, he's like, he takes the gun and it's like, sh- sh- boom, shoots yeah. him in the face. And then it's, he cocks it again and sh- when he puts the gun up and then fucking fires. And yeah. it's like, that shouldn't have happened at all, let alone twice. No, you should barely even be able to hear him. Like, it it. I didn't get to see what kind of trigger it was. I don't know if it was like a two trigger mm-hmm. or if it was the, you switch it over to the other barrel. Kind yeah, of I'm not sure. Yeah. I don't know which one it was, but either way, you probably wouldn't have, you wouldn't have heard much other than the gun going mm-hmm. off. Other yeah. than that, like, why did they have to add the cocking sound? Mm-hmm. I think it's just for that Hollywood pleasure to mm-hmm. the people's ears. Of no, yeah. It's... Hear the, Somebody cock a shotgun before they, that's shoot yeah. a zombie. No, that's yeah. that's what people just think that it's gonna be, I guess. But I don't know. Anyways, it was a big thing overall, that stuck out to me. What do you guys me. think of the episode? Oh, compared to the other two episodes, it was definitely a step down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I thought. But it was, uh, so it was still good. Like I enjoyed watching it, but there was just a lot of things that kind of stuck out in this episode mm-hmm. that were like. Uh, I don't there really was some like good that in it. There was some good in this episode for sure, but I thought it was a step down from what we've seen with the last two episodes. So Definitely, a it's step not down. as great as what I say the other two were. Still good, not as great. Hopefully, it picks up. I hope it doesn't stay this rate or get worse. I hope it steps it up to the first two episodes we've seen there. Where it brings back that intensity. Yeah, yeah. This episode didn't have that intense. intensity as the other ones did. We still got to see zombies, which I didn't think we were going to see zombies in this episode. No. I thought we were going to just see chaos yeah. amongst people. But they showed quite a bit of zombie, like quite a bit of up close with the zombies. Yeah. And mm. I still just didn't feel that intensity that the first two episodes showed. So. What about you? Same? Yeah, I like. Well, it was definitely a step down from the other two. The other two, for sure, it's like, it, yeah, yeah. For nothing, nothing was as good as the pilot. I don't think, and it, the rest of the season probably won't be. Well, so, hopefully, you never, well, you never know. That's mm-hmm. hopefully we'll get to see Tobias. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Tobias. Yeah, Tobias. Tobias, yeah. Tobias yeah. <laughs> I, yeah, Tobias. But yes, yeah. yeah. Anyways, that's our thoughts on episode three, the dog. Let us know your thoughts down below, and like the video, and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching. Never stop learning.